What is up, everybody? Um, back with another video, man. Terry into the recruit difficulty errors over RP only fans by Bird, man. You know what I'm saying? Let's get into it. All right, what's going on, guys? Get into we it. Had some pretty big news dropped yesterday. I mean, I um, if y'all hear like some music in the background, like a little, it's, it, it ain't that much. I'm looking at the sound waves right now. It ain't that much. We can definitely hear like, hold on, let me stop talking for a little bit. Okay, well, I don't know. You gonna hear it a little bit sometimes, but let's get into it. Mom playing music, you can't really do nothing about that, so, <laughs> yeah. I guess you could call it big news. I don't know, man. It was by far the number one trending topic on social media. I saw a lot of yeah. different opinions about the situation. I think people are a little confused about what's going on, so I actually did some investigating into the situation, and I think I got a pretty decent idea of what's actually going on. So, OnlyFans is going to be making some changes to their policies of what can and cannot be posted on the site. Now, originally... I don't really understand why they're adding that. Like, if you're it's a pay subscription, you should be able to post whatever you want, but, like... I mean, the people they have taken it too far. Not going to lie, but when the news broke, it was kind of vague. They didn't really explain it. Not a lot of details were out there, but it said something along the lines of, "Oh, OnlyFans is now going to be banning all sexual content." So of course, everyone starts freaking out. Because if you ban that, like, what's left? I I'm not sure they have any other type of content on there. I could Facts. be mistaken, but I've never seen anything else on there. So that doesn't really make much sense to do that, right? Yeah, so, really of dumb. course, all of the OnlyFans girls start freaking out on Twitter, right? Their biggest fear in life has come true. <laughs> it's time to fill out a job application. And then, of course, on the other hand, you have all the dudes who are using this news to get the memes and all the jokes out there. It's hilarious. So the combination of both of these forces pushed this to the number one topic in the world, I would say, yesterday. But if you actually get past all of that and you actually look into some of the details of the situation, you will realize it's not quite what it seems. It is a change, but the change is not as drastic as it would imply. So they're not banning sexual content in general, like just everything. From what I understand, hold on real quick, just a disclaimer. This is from what I understand of the situation. I could be wrong. I just did some very basic research on it, but I, I think this is correct. So they're not banning sexual content content in general they are only banning porn itself so if you ain't getting like pounded out you're good <laughs> all right so all the girls that are just posting like regular nudes and ass and stuff like that that's fine or even the girls who don't even post that they just post like bikini pics or whatever actually you know what that's who should be getting banned all right Free the porn stars <laughs> and start banning these ig pic <laughs> posters all right those are the real scammers get them out we need all those pics back on IG for free. That, that's what we need. But regardless, I don't have the statistics or anything, but I would imagine most girls don't fall under this category. Like most of them mm. aren't posting themselves getting pounded out like that yeah, on there. I and that. I know this whole time, I keep saying girls, so disclaimer real quick, right? I, I know I keep saying girls. Obviously, all of this applies to guys as well, but clearly OnlyFans is a very girl-dominated industry, platform, whatever. So that's the reasoning. Anyways, regardless, let's move on. The reasoning they gave behind this whole situation, why they are doing this, um, they gave a couple reasons. Number one, they said they were having some trouble finding investors for the company, which that does make sense. Yeah, I think I think it's they're trying to get more advertisements. But I don't understand, like, why do y'all need more advertisement? Like, bro, y'all, like, literally one of, like, the biggest companies right now, bro. Like, what? I don't, like... Right? Obviously, not everyone is going to be comfortable associating with this type of business. So, they're trying to clean it up a little bit. And then, number two, they were worried about the 
payment processors withdrawing their support because if y'all remember like i think it's probably been like a year or so now they made like a huge change to the hub because all the credit card companies were threatening that they were going to take away access or whatever if they didn't so now the hub is a completely different site than it was like three years ago or whatever we won't ever have prime hub again man r.i.p <laughs> to a legend but that being said those were the two concerns that they were worried about, which in my opinion, I think those are both two very valid concerns. Like, I don't know if you can really be too upset about that, right? So in that case, I think it's time to look for a solution, which I actually don't think it's that big of a deal because there's plenty of solutions to fix this, right? Number one, just post that type of content on another website. There is plenty of other websites out there. It's not like OnlyFans has some monopoly on the industry. Like you could just go post that somewhere else and still get paid for it, no big deal. Number two, you don't have to be getting bent over. You know what I mean? You could just post some <laughs> ass, no meat, okay? Just ass, just post some <laughs> cheeks, you good. You could still get paid. I'm sure your fans would be very interested in those pictures as well. We know that there's plenty of people who are very successful just posting stuff like that on there. So you could just post that on there. And then if you want to continue posting some wilder stuff, you post that on a different website. Oh, so dang, I, I think mic, there's huh? plenty of pretty easy solutions out there. You know, I, I didn't even really put much thought into it. I mean, I don't really care. It's not my thing. But, you know, just off the top of my head, I came up with two pretty good ideas, I would say. So, you know, I, I think it will be be okay it's a bit of an extreme reaction right now but long term i think it'll be all right you know and i'm speaking from experience well actually hold on let me clarify what <laughs> i mean by that not my experience of posting ass online but we did experience a very similar situation here on youtube a couple years ago when all the advertisers pulled out oh my god that they, was so bad huge changes to all the community guidelines and stuff on you like bro i used to be monetized bro I used to be monetized, now I gotta get a thousand subscribers and a thousand watch hours, bro. I used to be monetized, you know, they changed it. That hurt, that hurt big and small creators, because now, um, it's way harder to get monetized, like, videos get demonetized way more and stuff, like, bro. Oh, brother. YouTube, and, you know, we all thought this shit might be over, right? Time to get a job, right? But... It ended up being okay in the long run. We adapted. We changed our content to fit the rules. All the advertisers came back, and we're good. So I think in the end, it will be all right. I wouldn't be too worried about it, ladies and men, I guess, as well. And, and all the other genders, I don't know. There, I'm sure there's plenty of other ones on there, but you know, it'll work out. I wouldn't stress about it too much. But uh, yeah, that is pretty much it for the video. That is uh, the news. As far as I understand it, there's probably some more details out there if you're really that interested in it. But I think that's the general breakdown of the situation. This was just like a perfect storm of everything coming together, right? Because like the number one joke for like the last two years has been like, oh, these people need to get a real job or whatever. So now that this news finally breaks, everyone's like, oh my God, they got to get a real, you know what I mean? <laughs> like it, it just all like came together so right. perfectly. You couldn't not make jokes about it. You know what I mean? But I, I seriously don't think it's that big of a deal. But anyways, y'all let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below. Be sure to leave a like rating if you enjoyed. Subscribe if you are not yeah, already bro. fun. That's going to be the end of this video. You know what I'm saying? Like, comment, subscribe, and we out, bro.